What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the jail, guys. The Marauder. It's about that time. Not sure if it'll bust off, but we're going to give it hell today. So let's go. All right, so last we spoke, lots and lots of progress. Hey, it's getting close. Closer. <laughs> Closer, yeah. So, couple things here. We haven't updated you guys on this thing in a while. Um, got all of the cooling system pretty well plumbed, save for the uh, intercooler and um, all of that for the supercharger. Got some uh, oil separators all hooked up. Uh, fuel system. Ooh. Return style fuel system done. So overall, had to get a couple of harnesses. Uh, shout out to uh, HPR Automotive for hooking us up. Get the uh, harnesses we needed for the throttle body, supercharger, all of that good stuff. And uh, quick note, I did not update you guys on what we ended up doing uh, header wise. All right, so in effort to uh, get this thing kind of halfway rolling this is what we had to do so the the passenger side header did work and this is the one we did on the mock-up it worked pretty good the driver's side which we thought was going to be a lot easier or at least it looked like it when we mocked it up on the floor just sitting on the crown vic frame proved to be the difficult side so what we've got on this side is a factory 11 to 14 mustang manifold um and it worked out pretty good pretty good clearance everywhere um not real sure about headers in the future you know, this will probably work i don't know what It'd you thought nice for a good it, it would food, yes but, you know. <laughs> so anybody watching this that makes headers for these things for the panther platform with a coyote hit us up we'll be glad to do an install video for you but we're hearing we're hearing dinging we got lights see what happens yeah maybe i don't know We'll see. <laughs> Damn! Wow! It just fired right the hell up! <laughs> yeah. Uh oh. Couldn't hear myself think. Yeah. No. You don't even, do you have a pedal plugged in? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's plugged in. It's not mounted. It's just, it's just sitting there. Yeah, it's just there. sitting there, yeah. <laughs> Damn, I was thinking it would take a little while. It don't matter. You get fuel pressure. That's all you need. Yeah. That's fuel all Fuel pressure and everything hooked up. Yeah. They don't, even, they don't even need oil. There's fuel sitting there. That's pretty awesome. So it's still got the tune in it for NA, mm -hmm. but. Yeah, we have to get a tune. Yeah. Got this bigger throttle body and yeah, blower. It's used to the stock throttle body and no blower. Oh yeah, injectors are different too. Mm -hmm. So those are the LU 47s. Is 55s. that what those? What are they? 55s. 55s. Okay. Which are GT 500, aren't they? I don't know. One of those things. Whatever Ken sent. Whatever Ken sent. Thanks, Ken. Yeah. Shout out to HPR Automotive. Damn. Sounded good. Way high, huh? Yeah, uh, just because it's so freaking awesome. Oh, no. And it died. <laughs> Man, that freaking thing is loud. Jeez. Yeah. Yeah, exhaust, yeah. <laughs> Oh my God, that is freaking awesome. Guys, one thing, and I don't even know if you can see it, right down there, we've got the Volvo power steering pump on it. So it does have electric power steering, which is pretty freaking sweet. And what if we don't have the pedal mounted, nobody makes a uh, Coyote pedal mount kit for these. So anybody who wants to, feel free so <laughs> the pedal is just uh it's plugged up but it's not mounted so it's gonna go in there 
we'll probably just have to fab something up um yeah it is freaking alive actually let's get it in there we gotta show them the fuel system the fuel system looks great on this thing all right guys so there is the fuel system we did have to convert to return style but she's all plumbed Yeah, she's got fuel and actually did uh, speak with Stiflers and they've got a cross member coming. So we'll have a proper Stiflers cross member for the 6R80. Can't wait to get that. And one other quick thing, if you're trying to do this with a Crown Vic or a Grand Marquis, you're not going to have what the Marauder had, which is extremely nice, which is limited slip, 355. So the rear end is already good to go. Uh, for this Get ready to do some heavy-duty uh, tire smoke here shortly All right guys, so there you go Marauder is alive lots more to do obviously um, But huge step in the right direction um, The cool thing about this one we basically had everything here and was able to throw it together really quick But this is gonna be freaking sick big smoky burnouts no hood blower wide. You're not gonna want to miss it It's gonna be freaking awesome so guys i hope you like this one uh stay tuned for lots more coming uh make sure you smash that subscribe button we'll catch you on the next one